Binance, the world's largest crypto exchange, said it will list the recently launched new Luna token after a successful airdrop last week. But the symbolic will be listed under Binance's Innovation Zone, a trading platform for new, high risk tokens. Trading in the tokens will open on May 31st. Luna 2.0 had a fairly volatile launch, tumbling as much as 80% in the initial not many long stretches of trade on Saturday. The token appears to have stabilized for the time being, and is trading at around $5. Welcome viewers to my channel, please subscribe, like my video and turn on notifications so you don't miss our next update. Please take note, this is not financial advice. About 1 billion new Luna tokens were airdropped to holders on the old Terra blockchain, which is presently called Terra Classic. Binance and most different exchanges had supported the airdrop. Binance lists Luna 2.0 as high-risk asset in its announcement of the listing, Binance reiterated that the innovation zone consists of tokens that pose a much higher gamble than other cryptos. Different tokens listed on the platform include Elrin Network, ERD, Kava, and Sandbox, Sand, Binance expects traders to complete a questionnaire as part of the initial disclaimer for trading in the innovation zone. Different exchanges didn't appear to be as cautious as Binance. Communications from majors such as OKX, Huobi, Qcoin, and Bibit recommend they have enabled regular spot trading for the token after raising sufficient liquidity. Binance's stance may also originate from CEO Changpeng Zhao, who had harshly criticized the Terra crash, as well as organizer Du Quan. Launch comes in under a month since Terra crash the new Luna comes less than a month after Terra Classic lost nearly all of its value in a historic crash through May. This was set off largely by the depaying of its stablecoin UST. Terra 2.0 doesn't include the stablecoin, and has also excluded the private wallets of Duquan, Terraform Labs, and the Luna Foundation guard the three substances widely held responsible for the crash. Still, Luna Classic, LUNC, and UST prices rose after the airdrop. Last week Luna's airdrop was all in all a success. Presently, Binance, the world's largest crypto exchange, announced that Luna 2.0 will be listed on its platform. Be that as it may, Binance's Innovation Zone, a high-risk symbolic trading platform, will list the token. The tokens will be available for trading on May 31st. The price of Luna 2.0 dropped by 80% in the initial not many long stretches of trading on Saturday. For the present, the symbolic looks to have reached a level of stability, and it is currently trading at roughly $5. On the previous Terra organization, which is currently known as Terra Classic, almost 1 billion new Luna coins were airdropped to holders. The airdrop was supported by Binance and the majority of different exchanges. Luna 2.0 lists in Binance Binance, while announcing its listing, stated that the innovation zone contains assets that are significantly more dangerous than other cryptos. Elrin Network, ERD, Kava, and Sandbox are among different tokens which will list on the site, Sand. To trade in the innovation zone, Binance needs traders to complete a questionnaire. Different exchanges didn't appear to be taking the same precautions as Binance. Major exchanges including OKX, Huobi, Qcoin, and Bibit have all said that they have authorized regular spot trading for the cryptocurrency after obtaining sufficient liquidity. Binance's opinion could also be the impact of CEO Changpeng Zhao's serious criticism of the Terra crash, along with its pioneer, Du Quan's stance. LUNC and UST price rose after airdrop the launch of the new Luna comes little more than a month after the Terra Classic virtually lost its worth in a recent price crash. The UST depaying had a major contribution to the crash. The Terra 2.0 excludes the stablecoin, along with Duquan's, Terraform Labs, and the Luna Foundation Guard's private wallets. These are the ones that are blamed for the crash. Notwithstanding, there was an increase in Luna Classic, LUNC and UST price after the airdrop.